So, we just saved the town from the warden. So now, the only logical thing we can do is sacrifice cows. So after we sacrificed the cows to the skulk gods, we then decided that we need to give this town a name. And what better name than Morbington. So, now it's day number whatever on this server, and now the map looks a little bit different, so I thought I'd show y'all pretty much everything new so far. Now I know there's a big portal thing off in the distance, but we'll come back to that. For now, let's talk about that giant chicken right there. So this giant chicken is actually somebody's house. Now let's move on to some more new stuff. Now I got a basement with some discs. Well, actually, I didn't collect any of them. That was all awesome industry. So apparently while I wasn't online, there was a whole election that took place and apparently Sly ended up winning. You know, the guy who brought a warden up to the surface. Speaking of Sly, his house blew up. Surely it has nothing to do with him winning the election. But forget about that, because we got an enchantment table now. I know we had this in part one, but I never fully told y'all about it. Bruh. Oh yeah, forgot to mention, there's also a town hall. So at this point, everything's been going a little bit too smoothly. Something was bound to happen eventually. And sure enough, something did happen. We thought Sly bringing back only one warden to the surface was hard enough, well this time, he brought two.
It was at this moment that he knew he fucked up. That final fight with the warden made me realize that I'm pretty poor on this realm. Luckily, Awesome Industry ended up giving me some diamonds so I can make some armor. And after that, Awesome Industry also started working on a sheep farm. Soon enough, our house got a little burnt. I don't know who did it or why they did it, but that's not important to the plot, so moving on. Now for the moment y'all have been waiting for, let's see what this big portal machine thing is right here. Right before I went up the ladder, I got a warning from Luke. He says that what I find up there will be disturbing. But that warning didn't stop me from going up the ladder and seeing a piglin farm. <laughs> Even though they were murdering thousands of my people, I couldn't do anything about it. I couldn't stop them now. So instead, I'm gonna go to my basement and party.